Hi guys, good afternoon. Today is Thursday. I realize I haven't filmed one single thing for this week's video and I'm getting really nervous because <laughs> uh, I usually have kind of like a bunch of stuff filmed um, but not this time, no. Uh, so yeah, welcome. My hair, it's looking color-wise okay but it's so dull. I haven't done anything to it in the past week. We can all understand why it's been really crazy. Anyway, see you tomorrow. Don't do anything crazy until tomorrow. I mean, you're going to see this in a couple of seconds, but uh, yeah, see you tomorrow, guys. <laughs> oh my god this is yeah let's just like it's it's okay hi guys welcome to am i on focus man <laughs> okay <laughs> <coughs> hi guys um today's friday <clears throat> i hope you didn't do anything crazy in between thursday and friday anyway so today i decided that i'm going to draw something because it's been a while since the last time uh, we drew something together, you and I. <laughs> so um, I asked you guys on Instagram if you could give me any suggestions for things to draw today. And a couple of you guys said like, it would be great if you could draw something on New York today. The thing is guys, I don't know if you can see. No, you can't. Today has been raining like crazy. There's like a thunderstorm going on right now. So no landscapes today. <clears throat> uh, I can't go to a coffee shop. Can you hear that? I don't think I'll be able to go home today. I mean, I am overreacting, obviously. Um, I just had lunch. It looks gross, but it was actually really nice. And I needed some sweet tangerines for my immune system. Um, so yeah, today, 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 I'm all by myself, you guys. Look at this, amazing. Um, let's see if I can do this sketch today. Hopefully we can start painting this illustration and finish the final shashashashes on Monday. So yeah, I'm going to read your comments now and see what crazy ideas you just gave me. So I read all of your comments, guys, and there are a bunch of them. So thank you so much for taking the time and writing down a few suggestions for me. There's a bit of everything. Uh, there are weird ideas, there are <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, there are amazing ideas, interesting ideas. So I think I'm going to pick one and um, this is, I have no idea how I'm going to draw today, guys. It's very dark in here. <laughs> I mean, you can't tell because I pumped the light up um, on my camera. Can you hear that? Anyway, uh, give me a couple of minutes so I can work on the sketch and I will see you very soon. Okay guys, let's see if I can share what I've done so far. I have three ideas that I really like and i think they're really interesting uh first of them is this one which is a cat a pirate cat with a goldfish in a bowl um having adventures <laughs> i change the bowl part only because it will be more interesting for the fish to be walking as well and i think this can be really interesting the second idea is a bear a bunch of bears in a band playing and doing stuff like that. Um, playing and doing stuff like that. Very nice plan. <laughs> plan. God, what is wrong with me? Anyway, um, all of them being in a band. And of course, the name of the band is Bear Trap. And um, there are other ideas that I think are really interesting, but the other one that I liked is this one is, um, <laughs> what is the name? Godzilla drinking tea. 
and I don't know why. I thought this one could be really interesting, so I kept these three and I started doing more sketches for those ideas. So these are very quick, quick sketches, guys, but this is the bear band. Um, these are some sketches for the goldfish. <laughs> <laughs> Should I be enjoying this challenge so much? <laughs> anyway, I thought this could be really interesting and I don't know why I think they could be like a very good adventure couple, uh, like partners and... <laughs> anyway, uh, and this one, I don't know why I thought it could be such a nice... This could be a really nice juxtaposition. It, it's not even a word in English. I know it, it is in Spanish, but like a nice contrast between a monster about killing whole human beings and um, being like such a quiet morning before work. I thought it could be nice. Um, and I thought to put like a very Scandinavian kitchen on the background. <laughs> I also like put this detail. I don't know if you guys notice, but a bunch of humans um as snacks <laughs> anyway i honestly can decide between these three ideas because i think they're really cool um kudos to everybody who um gave me suggestions especially these three people i have no idea which one to do guys because i feel very attracted to all of this so let's let's ask ed what he thinks Tengo. La gente presentó varias ideas, entre esas esta. Yeah. Entonces acá eh, estas son las tres ideas que más me gustan: Godzilla, oso y el gato. Uh -huh. Y aquí empecé a hacer más como refinar las ideas. Re refinar las ideas. Pero esto puede ser un ensayo. Lo que ves creo que la energía de este gesto como es muy clásica del. Este es un gesto muy clásico de de músicos. Mm. De hecho, espérate. Esta cara. Sí, a mí me gusta. Gracias. Hi, guys. <laughs> That was weird. Anyway, um, I am at the office right now and I just uh, finally finished filming a uh, Patreon Q&A, which is about an hour long. And now it's almost 12 o'clock. I think uh, before lunching, <laughs> before needing lunch, I'm going to work on the uh, sketch for uh, today's illustration while the video is exporting and everything. Uh, I have no idea how long it's that going to take and I'm really bad at sketching while filming because I get too self-conscious about it so please allow myself give me a couple of hours so I can work on the sketch and later on we're going we are going to paint together okay guys I'm making some progress the page as you can see is still blank but this is what I came up with. Um, I am very bad at drawing from memory, guys. I don't know if I can show you this, but on the way to the studio, on the subway, I made a sketch. Let me see if I can find it. So I don't know if you can see, you probably can't see, but this was my initial sketch for this thing, 
for the illustration. And I don't know if you can see, but the um, the perspective is as boring as hell because guess what? I have never had a band before and I have no idea why, how rehearsal studios look like and band practices look like. So this is the moment when you, as an illustrator, have to um, get in touch with your weaknesses. <laughs> Things that there's no way I can draw that. What I did was I looked for pictures of how band practices look like and I realized that it will be way more interesting to base the illustration on an already existing picture than recreating everything from scratch on my mind because that won't work. So what I did is I based the studies I did um, last week on the bears and this is what I came up with. So this is basically the illustration. I don't know if you can see, but the the base is somehow similar, but I love that in this case you can see the drums and the whole drumming section <laughs> here as a first um, layer and then you can see all the ingredients, <laughs> all the band members uh, displayed there. I changed this person here because I want her, her to be a keyboard musician do you say keyboard art keyboard person anyway uh, but i remained um i changed slightly where the drummer is but i kept the details of the rehearsal studio because i love how these details look like on the ceiling and i think it gives more realism reality real effect to this illustration and it, it actually looks like a band like a rehearsal studio uh, I am very happy that I did this, guys, because it's very hard to admit that you have no idea how to draw a space, but it's actually the best thing you can do from the get-go, because then you can uh, look for uh, references and inspiration on Google or on real art pictures, and I feel that gives your illustration like a new whole different level because you're basing everything on a very interesting perspective that I honestly wouldn't possibly, like there's no way I would have drawn that from scratch. So there's nothing wrong with um, asking for help and looking for references on Google because it will help your illustration. So now basically what I need to do is transfer this illustration onto that paper I am going to use my trusty good old Prismacolor Color Erase and once that transfer is done I will start painting. But before that I'm going to have lunch because I'm really hungry. So I see you after lunch and once I'm done with the sketch. So wait a second. So 
I am at the state in which I have no idea if what I'm doing is good or not. I did have fun though, although filming and painting at the same time is always very tricky. So tomorrow I'm going to keep painting this illustration. I think tomorrow I'm going to do all the outline and then finally I'm going to finish this bastard because it's taking way too long. And also tomorrow I need to edit this video, so hopefully I can finish everything tomorrow. Am I aiming too high? Um, I don't know if this happens to everybody, but I just use my drinking water as my brush water. So, very good friend. <laughs> anyway, wish me luck on my Japanese class and I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Have a good night. Hi, guys. Good morning. God, I'm so sleepy. I am very sleepy today. Am I out of focus? I don't know. Um, let's do this, guys. Today we need to finish this illustration and I need to edit this video. So let's freaking do this right now. <laughs> I think I'm officially done with the illustration. I mean, I could keep tweaking that bastard forever. This was super fun, you guys. Of course, the pressure of impressing you is still there. And I honestly did my best. <laughs> but it was really fun to share all the process because I think it's so important to... Um, if, it, if this experiment was successful in one way, it was to prove that it's super useful to have references from pictures from real life. And I, I hope I show you some of the process. This illustration would have been super different if I would have done everything by memory. Yeah, please never feel embarrassed to use pictures as a reference. 
because illustrators, we don't do everything from memory. That would be horrible. And that's why even Disney Studios, they use models to recreate all the movements and they do um, study sketches and they go to fields to understand how nature works and stuff like that. So yeah, my loves, I hope you had fun in this video. Thank you so much for all your recommendations. My Instagram was filled with <laughs> your ideas. Anyway, thank you so much also to all of my patrons because you guys, they allow me to buy um, these wonderful gouache paintings and art supplies and this amazing paper and pencils and everything. So thank you so much patrons for allowing me to do this super nice quality videos and for allowing me to rent a space such like this gorgeous space. You guys are the best. So yeah, my loves, I hope you're having a wonderful Friday <laughs> and a lovely weekend ahead and I'll see you next week. Bye guys, bye, 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 bye.